Do I get do I get hockey lessons from her? I mean, we can we're totally. Can we like, can we arrange that yeah. because I can't get the puck off the ice. <laughs> can you skate? I can skate. There you go. I can That's skate. The part. I, can't, I can't get the the puck to go in the air. I've tried really hard. What's up, Just Women Sports? I'm Hillary Knight, and today I'm learning from the one and only Danielle Kang. Okay, Hillary, I'm going to watch you some balls and see how we can uh, fix your hooks and work on some parts of your game. Epic, can't wait. It seems like you play golf. How long ago did you start? Uh, a couple years ago, but I only go like every so often in the summer. So can you put a club like this on you, on yourself? Yeah. Like standing? Can I do it standing? Yep. Yeah. And then stand up straight, just like stand up straight. Okay. And then the kind of like bend your knees and squat down like that normal golf position, right? Be comfortable. It's like a football player, like how they would like receive anything like it was like this before they squat down like this place and then just turn. Yeah. But then don't move your legs too much. Like legs are like, legs are your stability. So I just need you to turn. Okay. There you go. And then turn through. Wow. I need to work on my flexibility. Yeah. I think it's... <laughs> So go, go here. So it's just like the load. Like you should be able to feel it like here, like on this side. And then you just churn. Yeah, okay. perfect. that looks so good. That looks so good. You're doing great. You're doing great. Okay. And then you go through and then you transfer your weight and then go through with your lower body. Your lower body is your, your lower body. What is it? What is the hockey term when they say legs feed the wolves? Is that what they yeah. say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to like, you got to use your legs. Like you got to load into okay. your legs. And then like pretend you're jumping off the ground technically like and then yes so your body follows your legs this is just the basics of a golf swing yes oh it looks great that looks perfect okay not trying <laughs> i love it i love it all right rotate perfect you know how yeah. like, at times like you want to guide and you want to know where the club's going yep when you get to the top just rip it so cool. one of the things that you could work on is now that you have that feeling down on your backswing. So do you, you know how I explain when you go through, don't let your upper body lead instead of just let your lower body lead and then go. Yep. On your backswing, it needs to move together. Okay. So it's like a rubber band motion. You go up there, you coil, and then you pull a rubber band here. And then you go down. Like if I'm doing a really slow mo motion, we go up together and then it's like a rubber band coil. And then this, flexes down that's where yeah. you get the speed so on the backswing i need you to like move together and then on the coming oh. you just let the lower body guide you yeah it's like that's the tempo when people talk about tempo i like, <laughs> really like that one is this like the first thing you learn um when first thing i learned i what i was told to do is they gave me buckets of golf balls and they told me to hit it as hard as i can it didn't matter how i swung really? it didn't matter where the ball went i just went and swung as hard as i can Every single shot. That's cool. That's why I was curious, like how you started, you know, specifically, like I was driving. I'm like, oh, I wonder how she started. Cause for shooting, for me, it was, I could never lift the puck, like not until I was almost into high school. And so I just had a guy that was like, just shoot the puck as hard as you can. Like it doesn't matter where it goes. So I love that that, that was like your first teaching lesson, right? Like just like keep shooting balls. It's like, okay. Shoot so them as hard as you can. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Sometimes we get so caught up in technique. So when you're walking around the course, it like you're you're sort of like doing like this like high end visualization, like as you're walking to your next like shot. Uh so there are, so we are out there for five, six hours. So sometimes you right. check out a lot. But I do a lot of this breathing techniques and sports psychology where I have to feel the five senses. So instead of worrying about my result, which I do a lot and I'm sure all athletes do, right? We're in fear of failure and so obsessed with succeeding that we can't execute when it's time to execute. So it's kind of funny. I actually train to tap into the five senses. Um, when you're walking, I try and feel what I'm walking, what I, what's what I'm wearing, my hat, anything I can feel. Then I try and listen for the furthest sounds to the closest sounds, sight, taste, smell, everything. And by that point, I'm just trying to be in the most present moment as possible. Yeah, how did you learn all that? Because it just like naturally over time, you just have a bunch of coaches or is that something you just picked up? You know, I'm sure you 
feel this way too. Like we always feel like we fail more than we succeed, right? So we always yeah. want to be better. And for golf, we lose a lot. We don't win very often. <laughs> and <laughs> I, whenever I had something that I was going through or I was having an anxiety or mental blockage or technique, I always look for answers. And I feel that somebody out there has gone through it. I try and talk to people and then they refer me to people and then see what would make my game better. Because at the end of the day, you want to perform at the most peaceful state. This is magic, right? Because you're just like throwing this through the WebEx. Like you give me like a couple pointers. I'm going to go out there and just like absolutely crush it next time I'm out for a round and be like, yeah, like this is how it's done. Like no hours. <laughs> That's, that's just how it is. <laughs> I really enjoyed spending time with you. Thank you so much for connecting um, me and Hillary together, Cisco. And uh, Hillary, honestly, my only tip is just to hit it as hard as you can. Sounds awesome. Well, thank you very much for all the tips. And um, we got to get you on the ice sometime. Yes, I can't wait. It's going to happen. <laughs> <laughs>